Ce combat vous est présenté par Positive Festival. Catégorie Heavyweight Dans le grand bleu. A palpable air of anticipation here in the Teatro de Orange, Sebastian. Two big lads ready to throw down in front of 5,000 people. And this is an incredible way to kick off our main card. I mean, I'll tell you, I've seen Godzilla versus King Kong. It doesn't really match up to the tension you can feel here tonight. Feel like oh. Both these fighters are just one shot away from ending the fight. Morel doing the right thing, closing the distance, but it's a huge shot right off the bat. Oh, you can tell that the old packed some power there. Morel did not, oh. He lifted Morel off his feet. That's a heavy, heavy leg kick, and he's doing the right thing. I want to see him punch into a clinch and get the takedown. Big oh. knee! That landed flush, Sebastian. It just made the up angry by the looks of him. <laughs> And much like the Hulk, I don't think we'd like to up when he's angry. Oh, Superman punch there. Living up to the super power that we're seeing in here. These are really, really smart kicks from Morel. But right now he needs to be very smart with the grappling. We know how powerful Diop is, but that wrestling power also translates into knockout power. Oh yeah, absolutely. We've seen it time and time again. And honestly, Morel's defensive striking leaves a little something to be desired. He ate quite a few shots as he was trying to close the distance. Needs to dig in for a second underhook, trying to do so. Nice shot over the top, but again, he's potentially waking up a beast. And is Morel potentially a little bit gassed? Is he hit an adrenaline dump, perhaps? I think it might, that might be the case. He's been working really hard trying to get the takedown, and unsuccessfully. I mean, he's just blocking these shots with his face right now. Not a tried and tested means of defense. Oh, that's another big shot. He's closing the distance well. Oh, look at that. He might go for a guillotine here in this position. Diop trying to get in on an ankle, and the atmosphere here is nothing short of raucous. Oh, yeah. This is like a rock concert or something. It's insane. Look at that, Diop gets a takedown, he's in the guillotine though. Transitions beautifully, albeit somewhat slowly into side control. Could hit a north-south choke here. Yeah, that's a good point, Philly, very all good. Right now he's happy just to leather up the ribs. He potentially, I think he could hit the north-south here. You can see he's, he's just scooped underneath the back of the head. If he can connect his hands or get a hand to a bicep and put down that pressure. Yeah. Morel doing a good job to try and work to his feet. Feel like he's going to eat a big knee in this position, though. Yeah. Now oh, he's the one. Stuck in that position. Oh, eating some big uppercuts. Oh! Oh, he goes down! No way! That's crazy! Oh, my goodness! Absolutely crazy scenes here at Hexagon. Spinning elbow from Morel. He absolutely, he did not drop him. He de him. <laughs> this is ridiculous, ladies and gentlemen. This is Hexagon MMA. That was about a vi as violent a finish as we could have asked for. And we've got some violent finishes behind us in the preliminary card. Wow, that was insane. Ladies and gentlemen, you are seeing just now why Hexagon MMA is becoming your new favorite MMA organization. And he said, do not be deceived by Morel's physique. He is legit. Boom! Oh, picture perfect. Yeah, Diop was out. Those shots were unnecessary, but it was the icing on the cake. And he looked wobbled and just... I'm not going to say it was a, a Hail Mary shot because he threw it with the intention of landing, but given the yeah. confluence and the cadence of the fight, that was a little bit of a, a little bit of a, an upset, Sebastian. I mean, I think so. The body language from Morel was, wasn't very convincing. He, he didn't manage to get the fight to the ground like he wanted to. Oh, that gets better every time you see it. And there you see the orb who's without a shadow of a doubt, probably asking his corner what happened. Yeah, I mean, when he came to, it definitely seemed like he didn't understand what was going on. That is always a telltale sign of a brutal knockout. Right now, you can see just how much it means to Anthony Morel. Now one and oh as a professional. And 
An early contender for knockout of the night, huh? Oh, definitely. That's, that's one of the cleanest knockouts we've seen in hexagon history. A spinning elbow. Somewhere Keep Chanel Dyer is watching Keep that fight being mind. like, hey, I threw one of those. <laughs> it's like that Leonardo DiCaprio meme. I bet she's pointing at the screen. <laughs> What a way to cop things off. And Sebastian, this is just the beginning. Ah. I mean, like I said, it, those preliminary fights, it was truly just a taste of what was to come. The MMA ah. gods are truly pleased. I'll tell you that for sure. Oh, beautiful show of respect from both men. The off still a little bit uneasy on his feet. That shows you just how devastating and pinpoint what a way to make your pro debut. Anthony, je ne sais pas si tu te rends compte, mais il y a un homme il y a quelques années qui avait un short euh, rouge et blanc à carreaux qui s'appelait Mirko Crocop et quand il mettait des high kicks, ça faisait le tour du monde. Ce coup de coude retourné risque de faire le tour du monde. C'était prémédité Je suis lutteur, mais ça fait deux ans que je m'entraîne en Muay Thai. Tout le monde m'a dit, fais pas le coup de retourné, fais pas le coup de retourné. Mais j'ai prouvé que... Attends, fais qu'à ta tête, t'en as rien à faire. Exactement. Exactement, merci Monsieur Gérard Maillot, c'est grâce à toi. C'est toi qui m'as montré que ça vient de mes coudes. Gros big up à La Réunion. Et merci tout le monde d'être venu ce soir. On va dire au public que tu as accepté ce combat en ce qu'on appelle short notice. Lundi, quelle semaine de malade Effectivement, on m'a appelé lundi pour le combat. Ça fait longtemps, je suis prêt. J'ai une île de la Réunion, on n'a pas de combat là-bas. Donc je me suis dit, je suis prêt, quand les trains passent, je rentre dedans. Je suis rentré, ça a payé. Anthony was saying that he accepted this fight on late notice and earlier he said, spinning back elbow, my coach said, don't do it. You know what, I did it. Euh, ce soir, on en boit une, la dodo est là, non Ah, la dodo est là, mais pas essayer de boire aussi. Gros pick up Grand Bois, mon café de la Bresse, Grand Bois. Et merci tout le monde. Merci ma hat bon tibia. Ah oui. <rire> Anthony Big Morel, qui a accepté ce combat il y a 4 jours, bravo à lui.